Hi guys, thank you for watching my video. <coughs> Welcome to my channel. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Uh, follow me on Instagram at Lamar Townsend. Uh, like me on Facebook slash Lamar Townsend Official. Um, and yeah, I don't know what else I'm on. So yeah, um, subscribe to this channel. Contact me for your own personal reading at Lamar. L A M A R R dot Townsend at gmail dot com. One dollar per minute, forty five dollars for forty five minutes, thirty minutes for thirty dollars. But you know, if you want a twenty minute reading, it would be twenty dollars, ten minute, ten dollars. I don't really care. You know, um, I will read anyone for however long you want me to read you. Okay. Um, Paris Jackson. Is up for psychic review. I love um, Paris. I follow her on Instagram. Um, I don't know if she has a Facebook page, but I probably follow her there as well. Um, I love all the Jackson kids. Um, and I was actually talking to someone about uh, the kids yesterday. I won't say everything that was um, disclosed or said in that conversation. Um, However, I love the Jackson kids. I think they're very, very talented, um, each in their own individual, unique way. Um, and yes, so there's no shade here. By the way, you know, if I read on a celebrity, it generally means I like them because I don't read on people I don't like. I mean, I just don't want, for people I don't like, I, if I don't like you, I don't want to give you a platform on my channel of any form. Because the way I think about it is if I do a reading on a celebrity, I'm kind of um, giving, well, basically I'm giving them promo in some way. So it's like, do I really want to give someone I don't like promo? I don't think so. So, um... But, you know, it turns out some I haven't met a lot of these celebrities that I've read on. I mean, by the way, celebrities, contact me for your own personal reading as well. Um, I know that a lot of you watch my videos. Um, but yeah, I don't really know a lot of these celebrities personally. Um, however... I don't know, sometimes you meet someone and it's just like totally different from, you know, who you expect them to be or their persona. However, that's why I'm a psychic and I see straight through the BS. Straight through the facade, you know what I'm saying? Like, <clears throat> like if you meet me in person, chances are, like, I will figure you out, figure you, figure, I will figure you out within the first 15 seconds of us meeting I will have you figured out me looking in your eye I will have you completely figured out within the first 15 seconds who you are and what you're about um that's what psychics do well if you're a really really good psychic you can see straight through people and straight through situations mm. I have like a little gray hair on my side, it's like, I don't know how I feel about it, I mean, I don't feel bad, it doesn't make me feel bad or old, but it just, it's just like, wow, you know, I've lived quite a long life, and I have gray hair to show for it. <laughs> Alright Paris, I've talked for four minutes, so let's just get this started. Um, Alright Paris, so what are the energies around Paris Jackson? What can you show me is around Paris Jackson? What are the energies around Paris Jackson? What are the energies around Paris Jackson? What are the energies around Paris Jackson? For some reason, I'm seeing, like, her standing by a window or sitting by a window and, like, people trying to get her attention outside of the window. I don't know if it's, like, paparazzi or something like that, but I feel like this is happening overseas or on vacation or something like that. 
And Paris is just looking down at them like, what, what do you want? Like, you know? So, like, she just, she's like, you're so dumb. Like, well, what do you guys want, you know? Paris seems like the type where she just does not give a fluck. Knight of Pentacles. This is one of the cards that flew out, or one of the cards that kind of, sometimes cards in the deck when I'm shuffling, they kind of, um, jet, jet out. And I'm like, oh, okay, that card sticks out more than the others. I'm going to take it out and see what it is. Um, Knight of Pentacles, Future Plants, New Profitable Ventures. You're reasonable but, but overly cautious. Proceed faster. It's the right direction. So I see a lot of new things in the works for her. New projects in the, in the works for her in the coming future. Um, I do see a lot of offers that she's getting. A lot of offers. A stream of offers. And it's just like, which one do you want to grab? Which one does she want to grab and take? Which offers will benefit her the most? I feel like she might want to get into acting or something. I don't know why I'm also seeing like documentary. <clears throat> In the past, we have two of wands, mid-phase. You are between past accomplishments and future goals. It's time to pause to consider future ventures. Sorry, spit went down the wrong way. Uh, so I feel like um, Paris has people around her, or had people around her, that were trying to put her on one path. But Paris, like I said, does not. She's the type of um, young lady who, young woman who just does not give a fuck. And I think me and my friend were talking, and we discovered that she's a fire sign. I think we she's an Aries. I don't remember. But, um, she's gonna do what she wants regardless. Like, if she, if her handlers are trying to push her towards some avenue, some, some, some path, and she doesn't want to go down it, she's not gonna go down that path. They're not gonna get her to do anything she doesn't want to do. And I feel like she's been like that since she was young. Um, I have to be very cautious of the time, because I actually have to be somewhere in less than an hour after to shoot some video from my internship but I'd rather much be here with you guys you know um, filming videos and doing readings YouTube pay me more money so I can <laughs> do more readings um, and I have to take time away from you guys alright uh, the Sun in her current position success enjoy fulfillment self-fulfillment good health and vitality you will, will you will receive help from external resources or sources I feel like she has a lot of people around her who she has a lot of connections a lot of people who look out for her in in the industry in the entertainment industry like she had like people who she can just call up bring um you know um who who would be a Kathy Hilton? I need, you know, I need a, a number for you know so and so because I'm dealing with this situation. You know what I'm saying? Like she just she has connections, you guys. Um, and like they're big connections, connections with deep wealth, deep, deep, deep connections, deep connections, deep connections. She has deep connections, you guys. When I repeat something, it's important, by the way. She has deep connections. Ten of swords, pain, hurt. Though you've been mistreated and hurt, the pain is temporary. You will soon become stronger. So she's putting herself in the public eye again with some sort of goal in mind. Some, she has some sort of overall goal. Like she, like I know she just recently did this Rolling Stone magazine, and people are like, "Oh, oh here she goes with her mess again." You know what I'm saying? She just wants attention, yada yada yada, <clears throat> and it just seems like, oh yeah, she wants attention, but it's in connection with all the all of these projects that she has, or she will have rolling out within the next year, or the coming years or so. Uh, ten of pentacles, success, happiness, wealth, and joy are inherent and long-lasting. Good family life, success, in reference to your question. 
I think she's going to be successful with whatever future plan she has, um, planning. Um, I don't know why I'm seeing a documentary. I don't know if she's working on a document documentary. Maybe it might be like a documentary about her father or her family. Maybe she's participating in a documentary about her family, but I feel like it's in connection to her roots, the Jackson roots, whatever this documentary is. Um, but I also feel like she might be doing some acting of some sort. Does she sing as well? Page of Wands, Freedom. This is her all day, every day. She is such an individualist, you guys. Like, free to do whatever I want. No one can tie me down. Ugh. I can already tell I'm going to have to leave soon. Um. New Spiritual Journey. A trip abroad, abundance, freedom, and new adventures on the, on the horizon. She has a lot of new ventures coming out, you guys. She's working on a lot of stuff behind the scenes. Oh, crap, I hope my camera's charged. Mm. Damn it. Um, Five of Cups, Melancholy. You feel depressed as you focus on the negative. Recognize the positive aspects and you will feel better. She feels lost without her father. I really want to plug in my camera, you guys, but... I mean, ugh, who cares? She feels lost without her father. The, du the direction and guidance of her father. She feels lost. She's like, I have all these options, I have all these people coming at me, offering me all these great things, and I don't know which one to choose, you know what I'm saying? I don't know who's good for me, what's good for me, what's bad for me, you know, and, uh, you know I wish I had my father's expert guidance. I feel like there are two people behind her, though, that could be very helpful in guiding her in her career, and helping her make decisions in her career. Um, I feel like one of them could be family, or both of them could be family, connected to family, or family. But they're in the, this, the family's inter, in the entertainment industry as well. <clears throat> um, so it could also be like a family friend, the moon, vagueness. You have difficulty seeing reality as it is, re-examine the situation as your inner feels, fears aren't realistic. Hmm. Oh, Lord. <laughs> um. Is Miss um, Paris in a relationship right now? Because the Ace of Wands comes up, and I always see that this is like a penis. I mean, come on, people! It looks like it looks like a penis. Um. Is she in a relationship? I feel like she likes to get busy a lot, if you know what I mean. I mean, I feel like she likes to get busy a lot. She likes to get busy a lot. Um... Ugh. Oh, pears. Leave the boys alone, Paris. The boys may be... 
the boys could potentially be your downfall, Paris. Leave the boys alone. Be more discerning when it comes to boys, Paris, and and and, and men. I don't even want to really say boys, because you know you shouldn't be. I don't know how old you are actually. Um, what time is it? Ugh. I don't know how old you are, Paris, but coming from a gay man in his mid twenties. You know, I'm 25. Leave the boys alone. You know, they will bring you down. Go after a man. And a man doesn't necessarily always mean someone who is um, older than you. Um, because uh, sometimes they can be, older men can be manipulative. Especially with women. Um,. I guess with guys, it's a little, I'm gay, so I guess with, with me, it's a little bit easier because I understand the man's mind, whether you're old, you're old, I don't care how old you are, you know what I'm saying, whether you're 50, 60, 80, 20, you know, 15, like, you know, there are certain characteristics in men that's just inherent, you know, in, in, in men, um, so, be careful, Paris, okay, that's all I'm trying to say. Um, <clears throat> be careful of being used. Alright. Oh. Uh, number 12, Perspective, Archangel Chamuel. There's a better way, pause for reflection and insight, dare to be different. Paris, don't follow a path set out for you. Um, I feel like you could also have the possibility, possibility to fall into the trap of going towards a path that's set out for you already um, because maybe the path that you choose to go on your on your own your own path your own journey of self-discovery I feel like there could be a moment of like chaos um, in this journey where it's like oh my gosh I don't know if I can move forward I'm just gonna go to on this set path so I don't have to worry anymore like I see that the possibility for that and I don't want that for you because um, I feel like long term you going on your own journey of self discovery you going towards your own path will benefit you more emotionally psychologically mentally physically maybe even wealth wise i feel like it will it will benefit you more because i feel like going on a set path if on on a path where someone forges everything out for you and you know they're making you into something I feel like that could lead the for the potential for you to be used okay and kind of like used as like a, a pawn in a chess game kind of way and I don't want that for you okay so um four of Gabriel time for celebration abundant rewards for hard work release yourself from burdens and situations You can be free, make a courageous choice to change your situation, not seeing things clearly. There's so much to be grateful for, financial success, my promise of retirement, original wedding, family life. One thing is she, she will never have to worry about money, you guys. It doesn't matter how low it may seem she gets within her career, she will never have to worry about money. Ever. Mm -hmm. Overall, she's going to be determined. Um, she's not going to really care what the naysayers have to say. Um, and um, I think she's a good girl. Um, with a good head on her shoulders. I think she just may not have the best people around her, unfortunately. Um, and I think with age, with time, she'll become, ho hopefully, <laughs> my prayer for you, Paris, is that you become more discerning and choosing partners and friends and, and you know who you who you share certain parts of yourself with okay all right Paris all right people I have to go um, thank you for listening and watching um, subscribe to my YouTube channel and I'll catch you next time contact me for your own personal reading see ya